The Bruins take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. The Hurricanes get a hold of the puck in their own end. Fires it! Goaltender gave him nothing as it goes off the side of the net. Marchand's make-it-snappy zone ability is that quick release on his shots. He can fire them off before the goalie can even catch up to them. Ajo's an incredible playmaker, and with his third-eye zone ability, he can make deceptive passes to set up his teammates. I'll be watching these two players to see if one of them can really shine for their team tonight. Guys, back to you. Here's a short pass to Pesci. Can't make it work. Quick feed to Tara Heinen. Here's a pass down low. Moves it quickly over to Jarvis. Can't get it to go. And it's a quick pass to Hall. And now he angles it across to Marchand. Steps inside the line. Carolina's got it along the wall. And there's the save on the play. This is where positioning is everything to the goaltender. He can't see it, but the puck hits him through the screen. Picked up along the wall by Natchez. He was locked in there. Here's a blast. Oh, turns it aside once again. Good save. Positional save through traffic. From the point. Ow! Oh, oh, he gives up the body on that. Poked away at center by Pesci. McAvoy's taking a nasty whack, and that's going to draw a penalty. And let's see what the call is. The Hurricanes are getting penalized for slashing. The Bruins get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. Well, James, statistically, we know that you score the first goal of the game. You're going to win well over 55% of the time. So that first goal is critical. Now you've got a great chance because you're on the power play. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. The Bruins in transition at center. They've got a three-on-one. And the puck skips away after a nice defensive deflection. Stahl stick handling in his own zone. Gets a skate on that one to deny them. Scoops up the puck in front of the net, trying to clear the zone. All alone! Oh, he didn't have enough gas to get the shot off. Really good work by the defender to close the gap. And look at this ball. through center. The Hurricane scoop it up along the boards. Oh, that was like a car crash. There's the whistle. We got an offside. Past the midway mark in this period. Still looking for our first goal. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Poked away in the neutral zone by McLaughlin. Break away! Great save! going to beat him, but the goalie comes up large. There's a collision with some authority. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Boston's got the puck against the half wall. Carolina's gained possession along the boards. The Bruins have it from their own end. Here they come up along the wing. Centering feed! And that stopped! What a steal in his own end! The Hurricanes move the puck in the defensive zone. Stays with it. Stepan's got it along the boards. The Bruins grab possession to the puck. Centering to the middle! And that's intercepted! That'll put a bow on the first 20 minutes of action here tonight. We've got lots more still to come. Second period is just around the corner. Welcome back, everybody. James Sabalski with you. Period number two, the middle frame ready to go. 
Who will be the first to light the lamp here as play gets underway in the second? Well, we've got over 20 minutes played thus far. Ray, how have you seen things? Carolina is going to be hard-pressed to replicate that first period. And look at this. It's a parent all alone. Answered the call on that play. But he came out and challenged him. Good save. Quick pass to Tara Bynan. Now a quick pass to Pesci. Broken up at center by Marchand. Look at this. It's a two-on-one. Tremendous stop by Anderson. Looks to start the transition game behind the net. Looks to make a play over to Shea. The Hurricanes will play it from the defensive zone. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Bergeron. Oh, paddle stopped by Anderson. Moves it to Ajo. The Hurricanes pick up steam and are on the attack. Along the half wall with the puck. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Carolina's looking to break out. And the puck departs the zone. Takes it into the slot. Blocker save. Scores on the rebound and puts it home. Uh, goalie burps up this rebound here. It comes right back into the shooting area, and the rebound is put away. Boston's given themselves control of this game now with a one-goal lead in the second. They'd like to get another before they go in for the second intermission. You'd love at least a couple-goal lead going into period three. Grabbed along the board by Natchez. Puck grabbed by Zaka. Maintains possession. Great read with the stick. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Manages to hang on. Boston's got the puck along the boards. Carolina's got possession at center. Here's a short pass to Slavin. Carolina's moving it into the offensive end. Centering pass in front. Opportunity there. Quick feed to Carlo. Now he takes it over the line. Centering pass. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Moves it quickly over to Stahl. Boston's at the back end. Oh, what a stop. Anderson's not had many moments to breathe tonight. He's faced a heck of a lot of dangerous chances. Been busy from almost a opening draw for the puck and he's given his team a chance to win he grabs the puck here at the point and look at this they turn this offensive end into a pressure cooker moves it around he scores they didn't sit back after getting that first one they pile a back-to-back -back goal on here goalie just can't keep up with this He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. Boston's given themselves a little breathing room here late in the second. I would say the next couple of minutes before we get to the intermission are really vital. You'd like to go in just in the spot you're in right now. Quick pass to Polino. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Poked away at center by Fulbrook. There's the whistle. Let's get the call from the officials. Well, while he's arguing with the ref on the way to the box, the big clock's now got two minutes on it for the minor penalty. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. There's the horn. Two periods down, a third period to go. Stick around and join us for the drama next. It's about to go down, period number three. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro, ready to bring you the action. The Bruins go right back at it on the power play here and win the draw to start the frame. Good defensive stop with the poke check. 
The Bruins get a hold of the... He's got a step! And he comes up with a big stop on the breakaway! Almost like the shooter waited and waited and the opening never came. Carolina's got it in the offensive zone. Center and feed! Picked off in front. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. The Bruins take it from their own end with time running out on this man advantage. The Hans ready to join the play. Here he is in close. Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. Love the way that he shoots a snapshot on the move. Forces the goalie to move along with him and into a pretty good save. And he regains control of the puck. Boston's got a hold of it against the wall. Denied by Anderson. Jarvis plays it against the boards. The Bruins look to start the transition game. Boston's going on the attack as they gain the zone. Puck picked up by Grislyk. Puts it on net. And that stays out as he got just enough of the puck with the glove. And play continues. Carolina's got the puck. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. To the low slot. Gets a piece of it and will play on. Oh, you're not going to get a better chance than that, but the goalkeeper does a great job. Puck scooped up by Felino. Feeds it on over to Coyle. Look at this. They've got some bodies here on the attack. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Dead center. Excellent save. Moves it to Pesci. Back at the point, they set it up. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. The Hurricanes looking against the half wall. And he gets just enough of it to keep it out from the back of the net. Omar's able to make the save look really easy. Now he doesn't have to deal with the rebound either. Past the midway mark of the frame, and it's a 2-0 hockey game. The Bruins win it. Boston's got a hold of the puck. Here they come on the attack. Krejci's eyes are looking for three. He's got two in his back pocket. Dangerous player now. Boston's got the puck along the wall. And now it's over to Svechnikov. Here's a short pass to Pesci. And he makes the save. It's a tough part of playing goal here. You can't see the puck. There's a screen in front of you. You cannot give up on the play. You have to stay sharp. He does. And makes a really nice save. Oh, and a good textbook hit there. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. The Bruins have it now. He looks deep to Pasternak. Boston's coaches have really got a nice luxury to play with tonight. This second line has really been driving the bus. A big reason why they're in the lead of the game. And he takes the feed. Score! All you want to do is give yourself a chance. They were able to cut this lead to one. Now can they find another? I never was a goalie, but I know when I sat on the bench and it got late, you start thinking about the shutout. The goalie's got to be thinking about it. So late in the third period, and this shutout bid is gone. Here in the later stages of this period, Carolina's shown a new energy over these last few minutes. They got one back, but they still need one more in order to tie. Less than 60 seconds to play in this tight one. Boston's got possession of the puck. Quick feed to Grislyk. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. And there's a power play opportunity coming up here. And he stopped that one. And another call against the home team. It's just one of those nights. Yeah, I don't know how the night's going to get much better here. You can feel the frustration on the ice, but you can hear it from the fans. They've had it. Bergeron's got the puck, and they'll go on the attack. Lindholm's got it in the offensive zone. Gets the puck over to Slavin. The Hurricanes really need a goal here. They've pulled the goalie and the extra attackers out. 
Carolina's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. Moves it quickly over to Svechnikov. Sends the pass in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Well, a big face-off here, Razor. Empty net. The face-off becomes critical. Officials are set. Players seem ready. We're ready to get this thing back underway. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Final horn sounds, bringing this one to a close. How do you chalk up a win like this here, Ray? Is this just a case of good counterpunching? Uh, yes, you could look at it like that, or you could say we're just fortunate tonight. I've been having dreams about falling in love. It feels so real, but nobody is here when I wake up. Do you know my name? The devil's in the detail. I'm a natural born killer. Everybody, welcome back to Raleigh. What you're gonna do when the Kaniacs run wild on you here tonight? The officials there at center, and I think we are about to get this one underway. And here we go. The puck is dropped, and we are underway. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Taken by Skinner. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Darlene. Gains the zone from the right. Couldn't make the connection on the play. And the officials waving off icing here. The Hurricanes have it against the wall. And now he tries to get it across to Ajo. Picked up along the boards by Shea. Quick pass to Ajo. Cuts to the paint. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Moves it around along the half wall. Back in with impression. And it's in the back of the net. Oh, this was quick. Hard to believe the game can change so quickly by their early score. And it is something that nobody quite expected. Now, the only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it. Carolina's got a hold of the puck off the draw. The Hurricanes cross the line and gain the zone. Moves it to Natchez. A chance for the truck. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. The Hurricanes gain possession in their own end. Here's a short pass to Natchez. Takes the puck at the point. Pass broken up. Trying to gain a step. What a stop on the breakaway. Dip toes across the blue line. And now it's grabbed by Kutkaniemi. Receives the pass. To the front. And there's a great pad save. I think he just got a piece of it with his toe. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. And he made the save to keep that one out of the net. Puck grab by Quinn. Here's a chance. Score! He gobbles up the rebound and tucks it home. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. We got a tie game. The Hurricanes win the faceoff. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Quick feed down low. Drives to the crease, and he comes up with it. Quick feed to Bryson, and now he moves it to Quinn. They gain the zone from the left side. Buffalo's got the puck along the wall. 
Carolina's in now. No one back at 2 on oh. oh. You have to be ready for this puck to end up on his stick. He doesn't take any time at all. Goalie's got set. It's in the net. Oh, what a delivery. I mean, if you can shoot the puck like that, why would you ever be? What a quick shot. And that's in the net. Carolina's taken a one-goal lead here in the first. Deserved one-goal lead as well, but now there's so much time left, you can't even sit back at all. Cuts into the paint! Scores! And they go back-to-back to the back The momentum in the game changes fast. You get one, now you know you've got a leg up. You want to get another if you can. They get them quickly, and now they've really put them back on their heels. James, I think the, the quickness of the delivery of the puck is more important than the placement when you're in this tight. You're just trying to open up a hole for the goaltender. Getting into the later stages of this period, the Hurricanes have all the momentum right now, leading by two. Hangs onto the puck. Moves it quickly over to Stefan. Thompson's got it along the boards. Right on the doorstep. Clock ticking down here inside the first period. The Hurricanes get a hold of the puck with time winding down in the period. Here he is. Adrenaline going into the intermission when you get one this late in a period. Puck ready to drop here any moment to get things underway again. Carolina's won it. Here he is, takes the shot, and a solid save there as we play on. the horn to conclude period number one and Ray Ferraro's already off to grab his intermission hot dog. We'll be back in just a moment. from the low slot. The Hurricanes get a hold of the puck off the draw. Stays with it. Quick pass to Jarvis. From center, they get into the attacking area. Buffalo's got the puck. Slides it on over to Skinner. Tucks the victim of a slash, and the official caught that. We got a penalty coming up. And he lowers the boom there. And the officials will pass the sentence here. Sometimes the sound your stick makes on the other guy's equipment is what sets the signal off. That's a slashing penalty. The Hurricanes win the draw. Quick pass to Slavin. Passes it to Stahl. Looking to break out here on the power play. Two on one. Look at the Savardian spinnerama. 
stopped by the goaltender. Oh, another great save right there. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. And now he angles it across to Burns. And he keeps that one out. Big stop by the keeper. And that's stolen by Martin. Carolina has played a really good game here. I like the way that they've checked. They've turned pucks over. Now they want to make something out of all this puck possession. Pesci's up and ready to join the play. Carolina's PK unit gets their man out of the box. Hey, I think I killed two penalties in my life. Looked to me like the penalty killers did a good job there. They didn't really give up anything. A little burst of speed now as the puck's moved inside the offensive zone. Buffalo's got the puck against the boards. The Hurricanes gain possession along the wall. Goes full circle with the puck. That's not going to fool him. Sends a pass over. Jarvis plays the puck. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. How did he stop that one? That happened so quickly, that low slot shot. The goaltender's in position, and he makes the save. Scores! Right off the pipe, and a good break. As that puck can bounce anywhere, but he got the inside part of it, and it goes into the goal. Some guys, when they get in tight, like to shoot. Others like to deke. You can tell he wanted to hold this, and he had the patience to make the move on the goalie, hold it around him, and just inside the post. Buffalo's won the draw in the neutral zone. Poked away in the neutral zone by Kotkaniemi. Carolina's got a hold of it along the wall. Moves it to Svechnikov. Can't make the connection on the pass. And he slides it quickly to Pesci. Drives it to the crease. Taken along the wall by Oposo. Slides it across to Samuelson. Here's a chance, fires the wrist shot. Came up with a nice save. Stop that one. Nice work in there after the first stop. He's got to find the puck to save the second. Nice pass. Oh, and he just gets a piece of it to keep it out. My goodness, look at this. The pressure is really starting to cook. All alone. Oh, he got nice of what a save. Now he was locked in on that. The shooter prepares the puck, and the goaltender is right on top of it to make the save. The Hurricanes gain control of the puck against the wall. Poked away at center by Stepan. And he hangs on just as time runs out. And there's the horn bringing the second period to an end. All right, they say three is the magic number. Period number three is coming up next. Welcome back, James Sabalski ready to bring you all the play-by-play. Puck is dropped on the third, and if you love offense, well, stick around for this one. Ray Ferraro is back down at ice level. Ray, 40 minutes played so far. What's been your assessment of this tilt? Break away! Oh, Puck is like an anchor for the forward. He's got a breakaway, but he gets caught from behind. Can't get a hold of that pass. And now it's over to Tara Vinen. Takes the feed. And now he moves it quickly to Pesci. The Sabres have it from their own end. Skinner's got it along the wing. Let's see what the officials are calling. They're trying to defend that lead aggressively, but they take a penalty. Now the penalty killers really have to do the job. The frozen miss gets dropped, and we are back underway here. Sends the pass over. Carolina's on the attack. And a huge stop by the goaltender at point blank range. He's been really 
good on these high danger chances. And here's another one right from the slot. But he's tracked that putt to keep it in front of him and make the save. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Buffalo's got a hold of the puck now. Ray, I don't know about you, but I feel like this official might have to go into witness relocation leaving this building tonight. Yeah, it might be a decent idea to hide the whistle because the crowd is not very happy and it's not going to get any better. The Sabres with a two-man advantage power play coming up. They deserve this power play. The last couple of shifts, they've been threatening for the time goal. Finally, they earn a power play. Goes off a stick and off target. Oh, and a great heads up play to force the turnover by Cousins. Shea's going to join the penalty kill here as they remain shorthanded. Denies them in close. He's just so patient. He gets into a round of defending area, and he's still working for a way to slither his way through to the front of the net. He does it as well as anybody. The Sabres gain possession. Here's a short pass to Cousins. The Sabres carry the little ball. Burns is eager to get back on the ice. He scores! Now you gotta keep clawing back. Trailing in the game, they get the equalizer. Buffalo's made this must-see viewing down the stretch here, all tied up in the third. They've had to work hard to get this game even. Now we'll see what they can do as it's a new game. Quick feed to Natchez. That's intercepted. And that pass doesn't go. Slides the puck over. Quick pass to Slavin. Right up the gut into the offensive end. Takes the bump but still hangs on to the puck. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. Smothered that in close chance. The Sabres move to the offensive zone. The 360 with the puck. Slavin's lugging the puck. Moves it quickly over to Krebs. Stopped by the goaltender. Moves the puck across to Ajo. Right up Main Street and on the attack. Nietzsche has the puck against the half wall. Quick stop. Nice save from point blank range. Those bang bang plays are just that. So quick. Puck on the stick, puck off the stick. The goalie's got to be in the right position or they're not going to make that quick save. Turned aside by Anderson. Well past the midway mark of this period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. The Hurricanes win it in the defensive zone. Pesci's taking it from his own end. Moves it to Ajo. Here's a chance on the attack. Great defensive effort with the stick. And he had the answer on that play. Carolina's got the puck behind the net. The Sabres have it behind the net. Takes the saucer pass. Beautiful 360 with the puck. Quick pass over to Pesci. And that's broken up. Sends it in front. Another pass! Scooped up along the wall by Olofsson. Oh, quick work with the stick and comes up with the puck. Looks to get the puck over to Ajo. Pushes it across to Pesci. Oh, he had the right idea but couldn't make that play with the pass. Stopped by the goaltender. That flat-out reaction, James. That puck is coming at the goaltender from the low slot. There's not much time to think. Position, reflex is safe. Here's a short pass to Shea. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Trackbeer. The Hurricanes have the puck along the line. Tries to get it to Thompson. Nice poke check. The Sabres have it in the offensive zone. Here he is in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Carolina's got it in their own zone. Quick feed to Jarvis. And that's picked off by Tuck. Puck picked up by Darlene. Zero fear on this guy's part as he blocks it. Here's a chance. Big stop just as time expires in the period. There's the 
buzzer, and that means drama looms with overtime, and it's coming up in just a matter of moments. One will win, one will lose. Overtime will tell the story. Social media is buzzing with who's going to be the OT hero. It is underway. Quick pass to Ajo. Sends the pass in front.